Hello everyone, welcome to Wondershare Recover It, a platform where we help you tackle unexpected technical issues and recover lost data along the way. This video is for all the Windows fanboys who've been missing the conventional Windows Photo Viewer in the latest Windows 10 or 11 versions and who want to restore it to their system. If you've been using Windows for a while, you may remember that the Windows Photo Viewer used to be the official tool to access pictures up until Windows 7. In the latest Windows versions though, Microsoft have replaced it with a new Photos app, which, to be honest, isn't as fun as the Photo Viewer. Fortunately, you can restore the conventional Windows Photo Viewer, so in this video we'll guide you through the different ways to do this in both Windows 10 and 11. So, make sure to press down on the subscribe button below, and let's get started with today's episode. Now, before proceeding, let's first understand why the Windows Photo Viewer is missing from the later Windows versions. The truth is, when Microsoft released Windows 10, it also introduced a new Photos application, and that would allow users to access and edit pictures on the computer. However, this doesn't mean that the company actually discontinued the Photo Viewer. Instead, they just didn't release it as an official Photos app for the operating system. It means you can still restore the Windows Photo Viewer, even if you're running Windows 10 or 11 versions on your system. Now, the question is, why would someone want to restore the Windows Photo Viewer when there's already a better, feature-rich Photos application? Truth is that the latest Photos application doesn't deliver the same performance across all machines. Because it's a high-end application, some people often encounter unexpected lag whilst using the Photos app on a low-configuration machine. This is the major reason why the majority of users want to switch back to the traditional Windows Photo Viewer and then enjoy uninterrupted usage. Now, the easiest way to restore the Windows Photo Viewer and ensure that it's accessible all the time is to create a shortcut on the desktop. This way, you'll be able to access the application whenever you want within a few seconds. To create the Windows Photo Viewer shortcut, right-click on the desktop and then select New and then click on Shortcut. A new dialog box will appear on your screen. Here, type this address in the search bar and then click Next. Run DLL32. Open quotation marks, percentage sign, program files, percentage sign, backslash Windows Photo Viewer, backslash Photo Viewer dot DLL, close quotation marks, comma, image view underscore full screen. Then make sure to add an appropriate image path at the end of the address. Then when you click on the next button, you'll have to specify a title for the shortcut. Then click on finish to complete the process. And a Windows Photo Viewer shortcut will then appear on your desktop. Now, if you want, you can also specify the Windows Photo Viewer as your default application to view photos on your system. The process to set Windows Photo Viewer as your default application will be similar on both 10 and 11 systems. Open File Explorer and then navigate to any folder that contains images. Right click on an image and then select Open With. Then tap on Choose Another App. The system will now automatically display a list of all compatible applications. Here, select the Windows Photo Viewer and then tick the Always use this app to open checkbox. Then click OK to complete the process. This will now use the Windows Photo Viewer to open that specific file format. And you can repeat the same process for other file formats, such as JPEGs, PNGs, or GIFs, etc. Now, in case you've had to perform a clean install of Windows 10 or 11, you might not see the Windows Photo Viewer in the Open With list. If this is the case, you'll have to manually edit the registry files to associate all image format with the Windows Photo Viewer. This will then allow you to restore the Windows Photo Viewer on both 10 and 11 operating systems and access it from the Open With menu. To open the registry editor, type regedit in the search bar and press Enter. Now, navigate to the Computer, H key Local Machine, Software, Microsoft, Windows Photo Viewer, Capabilities, 
files associations key. Here you'll see two different keys, i.e. TIFF with one F and TIFF with two Fs. You'll have to manually add new keys for different picture formats. To do this, right click on an empty area of the right side of the screen and then select new string value. Now, name the string value as .jpeg and enter photoviewer.fileassoc.tiff in the value data field, then click OK to complete the process. A new string field named JPEG will now appear on the list. You'll have to repeat the same process for other file formats such as .png, .jpg, .gifs or .bmp. Now, while we're on the subject, we would also like to point out that there are many users who accidentally end up deleting pictures when they do not find the Windows Photo Viewer listed in the programs. If you've done something similar, you can use Wondershare Recovery to get those images back. Recover it is a full-scale data recovery solution that will allow you to retrieve different types of deleted files from your computer. Whether you've deleted a few JPEG files or lost a couple of GIFs, Recover it will allow you to get them back without any hassle. And since Recover it supports multiple file formats, you'll be able to retrieve other files that you've also lost on your system as well. Install Recover it on your system and launch the software to get started. Now, on the home screen, select the location from where the files were deleted. Recover it will start scanning the selected location to find all deleted files from there. Now, based on the overall size of the selected drive, it may take a few minutes for Recover it to complete the scanning process. Once this process completes, go through the search results and select any images that you want to restore. And if you want, you can also check a preview for each image before recovering them. Once you're happy with the selection, simply click the Recover button in the bottom right corner and then select the destination folder where you want to save your recovered images to. So that is everything you need to know about how to restore the Windows Photo Viewer in Windows 10 and Windows 11. Whether you've upgraded to these latest versions from Windows 7 or 8, or performed a clean install from scratch, all the methods we've discussed will allow you to restore the Windows Photo Viewer and even configure it as your default photo viewer application. Now, if you face any issues while restoring the program, do let us know in the comment section and make sure to drop a like on the video as well. And to see more updates like this in the future, don't forget to subscribe to Wondershare Recover It.